So score view is different than piano roll for several reasons, but I'm not gonna name those right now. You're gonna have to watch. All right, you've seen the MIDI notes, you've seen the MIDI roll, you've seen sustain, you've seen all these uh, modifications that we can do, pitch bend, sustain, um, editing our MIDI notes, um, and just in case if you don't see your notes, all you have to do is scroll down or up to find them. But what is score view? Because there's this guy right here, there's score. What is score? Well, what score is, is if you are more uh, classically trained, it is the actual sheet music. That's what's really cool about, about GarageBand is, it gives us sheet music and it automatically writes in every single note um, as it's, as it's supposed to be written down on a grand staff. Now let's take a look at that. So just click simply on score rather than piano roll. And boom, there it is. Here we have our grand staff and we have all of our notes already written out for us. So uh, we can even print these out if we wanted or we can export these out. And that's a, that's a great tool if you are more classically trained uh, for music theory or if you simply just want to write out notes, you can add in notes, you can, um, you can edit in here. But let's, uh, let's take a listen and watch because it's a little different. It's kind of cool to actually visually see on a more classical um, way or the, the more proper way of writing down music notation and watching that within a digital audio workstation program such as GarageBand. So let's take a listen. So that's pretty cool, right? So within the next video, I'm gonna show you a little bit of how to edit these, which is a little bit different, but still pretty similar on how to edit a uh, MIDI notation. So please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any requests, please send them to request at mahalo.com. Well,